Lord, this is the day that you have made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. Your righteousness is like the highest mountains. Your judgments are like the deepest sea. O Lord, you preserve man and beast. Yours is the greatness, the power, the glory, the victory, and the majesty. Everything in the heavens and on earth is yours, and this is your kingdom. I adore you as the one who is over all things. The Lord reigns. Let the earth rejoice. Let the many islands and coastlands be glad. You are the one who does great and unsearchable things, wonders without number. No one can discover your depths. No one can ascend to your heights or extend to your widths or comprehend your endless perfection. Indeed, you are great beyond our knowledge. The number of your years is unsearchable. Do you not know? Have you not heard? The everlasting God, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, does not become tired or grow weary. There is no searching of his understanding. Oh, how great are your treasures and wisdom and knowledge! How impossible it is for us to understand your decisions and your ways! O oh Lord, I am in awe of your unsearchable ways, for you show mercy to whom you want, and you harden whom you want. It does not, therefore, depend on human desire or effort, but on your mercy. I thank you for making me an object of your mercy and compassion. What amazing grace! What unmerited acceptance and favor! For I am your own work of art, created in Christ Jesus, reborn from above, spiritually transformed, renewed, ready to be used for good works, which you prepared for me beforehand. I rejoice that this is from you, Lord, and is your doing. It is marvelous in my eyes. My Creator, I acknowledge that you are the hand behind all the great things happening in my life. You are the signature, the sponsor, and the endorser because without you I can do nothing. You are the source of every increase I enjoy. All my blessings flow from you. And what sets me apart is special. What do I have that I did not receive? And in fact, I received everything from you, and I will not boast as if I had not received it, but had gained it by myself. But by your grace I am what I am, and your grace which was bestowed upon me is not in vain. What an incentive to live a life that pleases you, that brings you joy and glory. I am forever grateful to you, O Lord, my Father. As I have received this special grace, I employ it in serving humanity, as good stewards of the manifold grace of God. And God, I appreciate you for this overflowing work of grace in my life, in every way, always having everything I need, and excelling in every good work. Today, through the working of the grace of God in me, Sadness turns to joy and confusion, gives way to direction in the name of Jesus.